Gukan is surrounded by mountains with an average elevation of 398 meters. It has plentiful landscape. You can find a lot of attractions on Google Map. They are gorgeous and a lot of fun. Follow my step and let me show you this beautiful Gukan. Taoling Jiu Park is caused by an earthquake, which forms its various and epic landforms, like these bizarre rocks, steep river valley, and rich vegetation. This is Xuelindong Waterfall. You can see different color and shape of rock, and you would amazed by the marvelous power by nature. It's like a natural classroom. After visiting Taoling, I feel like jumping into my geography book. The slope is very steep over here. It's 45 degrees, so people have to hold the rope to move. Keep going up after Taoling, you will arrive Yunling Hill. It's a truly fairyland here. You can overlook the whole Yunling clan, tea garden, and farmers from here. Don't forget to bring your camera with you. You will be fascinated by this breathtaking, picturesque view. Konnichiwa! Feel like walking in Kyoto, Japan, right? This place is known as Five Yen and Tujiao. It's famous for its movie scenes atmosphere and Japanese-style scenery. Residents build this attraction by themselves using local producing bamboo. With a kimono, you will feel like flying to Japan in one second. Because of perfect altitude, Gukan is bound with tea and coffee, especially coffee. Gukan Coffee Bean even won the World Championship this year. Besides perfect environment, coffee planning skill is also crucial. Though coffee in Gukan cannot apply mass production like other countries. However, with careful study of farmers and support from government, price of Gukan coffee ranked pretty high around the world. I heard that a cup of Gaisha coffee cost people more than $1,000. It's Huasan Coffee Street. It's a coffee paradise in Taiwan. Every year we have our Taiwan International Coffee Festival over here. People come here to enjoy the best coffee in Taiwan. In Huasan Coffee Street, you can try all different kinds of coffee and roast coffee beans by yourself. It's a lot of fun! And also people can learn more about coffee making process. After a very complicated process, this will become the coffee we drink in our daily life. If you visit Gukan during holiday, I highly recommend you to visit Gukan Green Tunnel Park. Bazaar here is quite special. Of course, you can find traditional Taiwan night market snacks here. Moreover, you can buy smallholder farming fresh fruits like orange and pomelo. Also, all kinds of coffee side products. Can I get a coffee? You can only find them in Gukan. You can smell a pleasing scent of coffee from this egg. This is coffee sausage. It's not only a coffee flavor sausage, they actually have little pieces of coffee inside. In Gukan, on the street, in the bazaar, professional brewing coffee, it's everywhere. I grab my drink, gonna enjoy my coffee. Arrange a three days trip for yourself. Welcome to Gukan. Enjoy the best coffee. Run away from city and enjoy the nature. You will fall in love with this charming mountain town. <laughs>